if you are having less than 80% of GPU usage on your PC while you're gaming. So guys, today in this video, I'm going to show you how you can increase your GPU usage in order to get best performance out of your PC or your GPU. So guys, welcome to my channel. If this is your first time here, please subscribe, drop a like. And guys, also make sure to let me know your PC specs in the comment below. Therefore, I can help you to optimizing your PC further. So guys, in the very first step, we are going to disable the power throttling on our PC. Therefore, we can get the more GPU gpu usage out of a pc so for the press windows are together from your keyboard you will find out here this kind of their own window now simply type here gp edit dot msc and press enter now go for computer configuration administrative template system now you need to scroll down and find out here this power management folder so go inside it now here you will find out power throttling settings so go for it and open up turn off power throttling now here you will find out this window so guys you need to enable the settings on your pc for turning off the power throttling on your pc this will increase the performance of your cpu and gpu on your windows now hit apply click ok and close out of this so guys now the next step you have to update all the drivers of your pc therefore you can fix all the problem related to your gpu performance so guys for that right click on your windows start icon go for your device manager now simply go for your gpu so go for display adapter click on this drop down go for your nvidia gpu or amd whatever you are having now right click here click on the update for driver and go for search automatic driver so guys it is showing you you have already an updated driver but guys you need to simply close out of it and simply download driver booster on your pc in order to updating all the drivers on your pc your cpu gpu and every single driver so guys simply click on the scan button after installation of the software you can find the link in the description simply go there and download it from official website so guys here you can check it out here i have already updated all the drivers on my pc but here you can check it out here three device drivers are outdated and it's need an update so guys simply go for this update now button and this will start downloading and installing these outdated drivers on your pc you can check it out here i have already updated all the drivers on my pc so guys now the next step you need a powerful windows power plan in order to get the best performance out of your gpu so guys for that you need to go for your windows search search for power and open up choose a power plan window once this window pop up on your screen here you will find that all the available power plans on your pc so guys here is the high performance power plan you can choose it or you can create a new power plan but guys mostly you need to go with your high performance power plan now go for change plan settings set these settings onto the never and go for the change advanced power settings once you go out here this kind of pop up so go for high performance required a password on wake up so guys turn off the settings now go for your hard disk go for turn off hard disk and set it on to zero minutes now scroll down here you will find that your intel graphic settings so click on this drop down again go for intel graphics power plan and set it on to the maximum performance of your pc now scroll a little bit down here you will find that processor power management so click on the expand button and now you need to go for this minimum processor state and maximum processor state settings so guys go for expand and set this both settings onto the 100 percent after that hit apply click ok and close out of your windows power plan so guys next here we got power control this is exactly the same thing as your windows power plan settings but give you more options to optimizing your windows power plan settings so guys you can also download the software from the link in the description simply go and download power control after installation here you will find out this kind of the interface now here in the very first step you will find out the cpu settings for your power profile so go for this drop down and select out the high performance power plan from this list now click on the make activate and this will enable all the cores of your cpu for having the more performance because if you are having cpu bottlenecks that also reduce the usage of your gpu so therefore it is important to optimizing your cpu also so now go for the settings turn off the settings and guys follow the same settings on your pc inside the power control now here on the right side you will find that on battery dc this is for the laptop so guys again follow the same settings now go for these option and guys follow the same settings also from here now click on the supply button and apply all these changes inside the power control now hit ok and this application will keep running in your background whenever you turn on your pc so guys now for the next step for the optimization of your gpu usage you need throttle stop on your pc in order to fixing the throttling of your gpu so guys first of all here you will find out this kind of the power plan that is the performance then game then internet and then here you will find out the battery mode but guys we need the best performance while gaming so we will go with the game power plan now check mark on the high performance here you will find out all this power plan but guys go with the high performance now next here you'll find a clock mode 
set multipliers speed shift guys don't change anything from here just simply click on to the disable turbo after that now you need to go for this turn on button hit save and guys keep this application running in your background now click onto this minimize button and guys this software will also keep running in your background whenever you turn on your pc so guys on the next step you need ms afterburner on your pc in order to remove the temperature limit there we can get the more performance out of our gpu so guys here we got our ms afterburner you can download from the link in the description simply download and install this tool so after installation here you will find out this kind of the interface so guys here we got our msi and here is all the settings so first of all, you, the settings you need to change here and that is completely safe. That is your power limit and your temperature limit. You need to simply click on the slider and set it onto the maximum value. After that here you will find that core voltage. Don't change anything from here. Then next here we got this memory clock. And guys, you need to guys change it like to the increment of 20. Like by default we have the value of plus 200. And guys, you can increase the value with the increment of 20. Like increase it onto the 220. 240 like that and guys check the stability of your computer by playing the game and guys with the overtime you will feel more performance out of your gpu so guys once you have follow all the settings inside your ms afterburner now here you will find out this kind of the apply button so guys click here and apply all the settings inside your ms afterburner so guys and on the next step we are going to do some optimization settings for our windows like our windows graphics settings and our gpu graphics settings so first of all let's go for our windows graphics settings so right click on your desktop and open up the display settings now scroll all the way down and here you will find out related settings and under there you will find out graphic settings of your windows so open up graphic settings now you need to go for the default settings and there you will find out change the default graphic settings so go for this option make sure guys turn on hardware accelerated gpu scheduling this will reduce latency and improve your pc performance and also you need to restart your pc therefore all the changes take effect so we will restart it later so now you need to go back now simply guys scroll down and now you need to go for this browse option and add here all the games inside this list like for example you need to add the fortnite so go for browse now go for this pc local dc program file epic games fortnite fortnite game binary ribbon 64 and here you will find out launcher file of the fortnite so click on this add button Add the Fortnite proper option and set it onto the high performance of your GPU. Therefore, your GPU can give more performance or usage while you're playing Fortnite. So, guys, do the same settings for all the games available on your PC. After that, now simply close out of your Windows settings. Now, for the next step, we are going to do the settings for our NVIDIA GPU. You can also do the setting for your AMD if you have an AMD GPU. And, guys, for that, you can watch the full video on my YouTube channel how to do the best settings for your AMD control panel in order to getting the best performance. So, guys, for the NVIDIA, simply right click here go for nvidia control panel now first of all go for adjust image settings with preview and guys here you need to change the settings onto the use the 3d settings from your nvidia control panel therefore these many 3 settings can affect on your pc so from here first of all you need to go for this low latency mode set it onto the ultra then scroll down and here is another most important settings that is power management mode so guys go for it and set it on the platform maximum performance if you are using your gpu for the rendering or editing so guys go for this drop down and set this option onto your gpu that is your nvidia geforce or whatever that is now next scroll all the way down and here you will find the vertical sync and guys make sure to turn off these settings on your pc after applying the settings click on the apply button and close out of your nvidia control panel so guys before starting the last step here is a quick tip for you that is actually help you to improving your pc performance and reducing the temperature guys after every two weeks you have to clean your pc clean all the dust and that will guys improve the airflow of your system and guys by doing that you can reduce the temperature and increase your pc performance so guys now let's go for the final and the last step that is our windows register optimization and in the settings we are going to increase our our GPU purity for the games for that you need to simply go for your window search search for registry right click here and make sure to run this as an administrator now you need to simply copy the path from the description of this video paste it here and press enter this will take you directly into this directory so go for the system responsiveness right click here go for modify and change this value data onto zero and set the base onto the hexadecimal this week set your gpu priority to higher level while you playing games or other gpu intensive application ensuring your gpu can get the max performance out of your pc so that therefore you have to follow the settings and hit ok right now we are inside the system profile but guys you need to go for this task option click on this drop down and go for this games tab 
now from here you need to go for this registry settings that is the gpu priority so guys right click here go for modify and now you need to change this value data onto the 8 set the base onto the hexadecimal and hit ok now go for this priority option right click here go for modify and change this value data onto the 6 and set the base onto the hexadecimal now hit ok and close out of your windows registry now you have to one time restore your pc therefore all the tunes take effect then launch your any game and enjoy the best performance out of your gpu in 2024 i hope so you love it please make sure to let me know your input about this video in the comment below so guys see you again in the next video